Hi, I'm Curious Soapmaker and I made this video because I just got uh, a package from Amazon where I ordered some embossing soap stamps and uh, a cookie preset so that I can personalize my soaps. I've had some other presets already but I need more of them because I'm giving courses and um, so I wanted to try this. I found a few things I would like to talk to you about those because it's not clear and I would love to know it maybe before I bought them, although they are fine. Um, so first let's start with the embossing soap stamps. So I ordered two packages like this. The problem is that you don't see when you order it uh, what patterns are there. See? You only see the, the images where your order is only like this. Um, so I was actually expecting it to be something similar to this kind of pattern, and which is not exactly true. Let me show you. Well, actually, on the back of it, it's written uh, there are leaves, flowers, whimsical heart, dragonfly, Victorian, and handmade with love. But you don't see this when you in order. So and. I didn't know either. So here they are. There's eight of them, the small ones. This is the first one. I like it a lot. There is another one. I think the pattern may be too small uh, for uh, for stamping soap. This is there is actually a pair. I don't know which one is this one. Yeah, I don't know. This is another one. Some hearts. Handmade for you. And a um, very nice pattern like this. I think it's some kind of branch with leaves and flowers. So, um, I would say they are very various <laughs> and uh, at the end I kind of like them. The only thing is uh, they, are, they are supposed to go to the, um, it says it goes, goes with uh, an embossing mold and you have to put it in a mold and then pour the soap over it, which I don't do usually. Um, mainly if I want uh, the same pattern on all of my soaps, I would just stamp them. And this is difficult to stamp with, right? You have nothing to push on. So um, I bought uh, this kind of a log wood, which I, my husband cut for me. And I'll just very simply stick them together. And it will make a perfect soap stamp. So I, ha I have a handful of them already. So this will be the way I'll, I'll prepare this to stamp the soaps. Okay, so this is one type, and uh, for these square ones, it says <clears throat> Celtic flip flops, lots of hearts, florin pattern, wine pair. Oh, wait, okay, I, I guess I changed them. <laughs> I changed the boxes. So, this one is probably the Victorian leaves. There is a leaf. There is a dragonfly. I think this dragonfly you might, you might not see it very well, but it's too again too thin. The pattern might not stamp emboss well. Um, heart, nice. Hearts are always good. Then we have handmade with love. Okay, there is difference. This was hate made for you, and this is hate made with love. Then there is um, some kind of flower. Again, I think this is too thin, but I'll try it. I'll try it. And uh, some more leaves. So, basically, if you were expecting that all this set will contain uh, Something like this, which actually I thought too. It's not true. But they are nice anyhow. See? 
again the same thing and I will put it print it here uh, paint. <laughs> um, stick it there and then just input it like this so these were the embossing uh, soap stamps and now for the press set I felt it would be very easy because it makes sense you see um, you have some letters they're connected but you should separate them with scissors and um, then you put them into the fixing tool which is this one the blue one and uh, then you just put them in the order you wish and uh, just them it's not that easy and this, this is the instructions it looks easy but there is one small problem with that when you open them so we have your letters I think the size is quite good it maybe might be too big for some some and they are actually quite uh, deep you know they're they're big so um, if you're pushing too much uh, you will get something like like this which is very 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 deep and it doesn't look that that nice on the soap I tried this is my patchouli soap so we have to I think you get it after some time of trying but you really have to be careful when pushing it. but this is not the real problem the problem is that that you're supposed to put them in this fixing thing with which you then print in the um, these guys you have to separate first and uh, so that they stick together so they are actually longer so there are these things that are connecting them and if you just cut it anyway let's say very randomly cut a few of the letters okay. it doesn't fit perfectly well, you cannot fit it in because of these guys so um, it doesn't fit see so you have to cut it completely you have to cut the, the excessing parts which takes some time but it's fine I think it took me I, I have another one already cut and it took me like 15 minutes but that's not the problem when you have them all cut already which I did with another set the problem is that when you put it in oops let's try see it moves very very easily so if you're yeah that's what happens you have to fix it some way so that it doesn't uh, fall out of it which uh, was the problem I had uh, when I did this patchouli thing see and I had to put um, I think I took carton from the card box and, uh, and I just uh, somehow cut it and folded it and pushed the date in so that it keeps um, the letters inside. Otherwise, okay, I get rid of those. See? Otherwise, it will just fall. And this is one thing that I find very impractical. But again, this is also a set that wasn't very expensive. And uh, I probably do some small thingy from from some plastic to stick it there so it works so just a piece of paper and again so this one was used for the soap and uh, you have to pay attention not to push it too hard because otherwise it gets not nice again the, the size is like this which might be too too big for some so that will be all. I hope uh, it helped, helps you to decide whether you want them. And uh, well, there are links in the video so that you can click and, and uh, command if you wish. 
uh, to those I ordered them from. Um, the order came very fast and uh, there was absolutely no problem. Bye, so well. So these are the finished stamps. Actually, yesterday when I was showing you the packages, I only showed you seven from each because I forgot that I took one of each out of the package. I took them with me to the shop um, when I was shopping for the logs. So here are all the eight. And this is the one that was missing yesterday. Very nice flower. I like it. And these are the other eight. And the one that was missing is this one. It has some shoes and flowers on it. It's actually also pretty nice. So I like it. Thank you for watching and soap well.